splash. Ew, that. What is that? You need to go to the doctor if you're making a sound on the toilet. What? Did that just kill everybody? <laughs> Bro, y'all would not believe how long it took me to get this mic to start acting right today. Spike, I'm not trying to, bro, Spike. Man, Spike know how to make some good tunes, honey. What? Good job, welcome back, hey, to some more. You knew what it was, bro. You knew what it was as soon as you clicked the video. Let's not waste any time. Let's get right into this. Now, do not get mad at me, y'all. I know I hear y'all right now fuming with the possibilities of reasons to get angry with me over. Listen, 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 listen. I don't know how close we are to the class trial happening. I remember when we left here, Nagito was mad for some apparent reason. And it could be the next five minutes, bro. If this actually is a class trial that we're about to, to walk into, I still feel like I should wait a little bit. Not even wait a little bit, but just post this as its own video and then do the class trial because the class trials, depending on how long the, the first half of the class trial takes, we'll see. We'll, let's just play it. But just in case, this might be like a 10, 20 minute video, bro. And then I'm gonna post the class trial pretty, pretty soon after that, if not, if this is going up, my plan for this video going up is Thursday. Class trial can go up Saturday or Sunday. Come on, y'all. That's oh, that's still within a week, bro. That's still. <coughs> so I did what he said and checked them all, but none of the clocks had their times messed up. Jeez. But why do you ask me to do that in the first place? I don't get that bastard at all. Baby girl's quiet. Dang, it's good to see everybody. What's up, Chiaki? Yeah, we in the studio now. You know, I got I got some games downstairs, little arcade machines downstairs. If you want to pull up, maybe we can game. For now, why don't we head over to Strawberry Tower too? Along with the doorknob matter, there are still many mysteries surrounding this that we don't understand. If we go to Strawberry Tower, we might be able to solve some of those mysteries. Maybe, I guess, I don't know. You know how Chiaki be doing, bro. Jeez, you're pathetic. <sighs> Looks like that's all we can do. Let's head over. You're right. When Nagito said about the door opening, what is he planning to, excuse me, do about the chain? Look at, uh, bro, what is bro name? Golly, it's been long, bro. It looks like it won't come off easy. So does Nagito have a plan or something? Jeez. I don't understand this at all. Um, well, let's try, I guess. There's a chain wrapped around the doorknob on the door in the far back. Is this supposed to be a lock? It's not like they can open the door from the other side. But still, why did they have to do that? What was their reason for locking Strawberry Hall's door from the inside? Hmm. I'm sure we already looked at all this, right? Oh, well, I have to investigate this whole room again? Okay, so there's a, bit, there's a big hammer on the ground, cool. It may be a potential weapon, but I feel like it's a little too clean. If it's the weapon, it makes sense if it was a little dirtier. And where did the killer get this hammer? I've never seen anything like this before now. Only thing I can think of is... You're right. <clears throat> I did go... <clears throat> what? Hold on, bro. This nigga is spiking spell. Hold on. You're right. I did go to a place that seemed to be the octagon. And I found many different weapons there. The octagon. 
They had to have a they had to have obtained it from there, and I can't read, right? It's the only place I can think of. <clears throat> Alright, let's talk to Gundam. The pillar next to the door is tipped over. Plus, a part of the pillar looks like it was shattered. Did it shatter when it tipped over? Not just that, there's a weird mark struck to the stuck to the shattered end. What does this mean? Also, the pillar next to the back door is the only one that's tipped over. The other pillar is still upright. Even the two pillars facing toward Grape Hall haven't changed. It's weird that this pillar is the only one that's tipped over. That has to mean something. Fair enough. Fine. Even mongrels like you possess a soul. And that soul resides within your heart. But no matter how hard you search the insides of this machine, you will never find a heart. What happened? Sinner? So where did Nekumaru <laughs> splash Nekumaru's soul wander off to? It's interesting to think about, don't you agree? Bro, if you don't Go to church Sunday, bro. I'll take you to mine, bro. You you got to get figured out. Would you like to investigate one more time? I'm cool. Um, should I just be asking people questions, or maybe I got to talk to Chiaki about? And none other than mom. None other than mom. Let's see what she wants to say. She's staring at Nekumaro's body with terrifying eyes. Hey. Blood's dripping from your fist. I'm good. It's nothing. I was just holding back my anger and dug my nails into my palm. Damn it. This is nothing. It, it doesn't hurt at all compared to Nekomaru. <laughs> Akane. I won't forgive you. I'll never forgive the killer. I'll beat him up so bad they'll never walk again. Okay, and moving on. Stay Jeez. over there. The Monokuma file isn't useful at all. Every time we get one, the information is all half-assed. Fine, fine. Here we go. Let me clarify. Don't get me wrong, but I'm sorry to say that I need you all to understand. Hey, hey. You purposely don't write anything specific enough to lead to the killer's identity on purpose, right? Yes. <laughs> hey, um, if I wrote something like that, you'd be able to find out who the blackened is. That's right. If that happens, the class trial won't get heated up. You stupid brother. And you shouldn't have prepared it in the first place. Ronnie's such a dumb child. You stupid little sister. You don't understand at all. The number of fans who are eagerly waiting for the moment I present the Monokuma file is over 100,000! That's how many live viewers you get? Where you stream at, Mixer? I ain't never seen you. 100,000 people? You're just trying to scare me with made up numbers. It's true. It's not made up. I have proof, you know. Very nice. Well. You wise guys should already know that. Hey. No, they shouldn't. <laughs> Don't make me say it. It's embarrassing. You're so evil. I'm not. <laughs> Why did they come here again? I should have kept my mouth shut. Now I'm just exhausted. Chiaki, what you got to say? But still. I'm sure it's painful for Kazuichi to do something like this, too. I'm sure it's painful for Kazuichi to do something like this, too. We can't let this go to waste. We need to find something no matter what. And Sonya Nevermind, who has stayed awfully quiet this whole time. I am terribly sorry. But I simply cannot investigate Nekomaru's body. And you're a suspect. Prime suspect. It's a picture of Usami's face with grapes in her mouth. It's nothing at all, all that strange about it, though. All right, so we talked to everybody in here. Let's go to the Strawberry Tower side. 
And I guess maybe if, maybe he'll fast he'll fast travel if I Damn click him. Right. Looks like everyone left. As long as Kazuichi finishes his work, we should be able to open the door in Strawberry Hall. But there's still a chain, you know. If that's not removed, we won't be able to open the door. Yeah, that's right. That Nagito bastard. What in the world is he thinking? Where is he? Let's talk to him. Um, let's just uh, try and get to what you call. <clears throat> Thanks to Kazuichi, the elevator is working now. All right, let's go. We walked into the elevator and made our way to Strawberry House. It's been a while since I've come to Strawberry House. What's up? <laughs> hey, you're here. Hey, hey. Kazuichi, how'd the repairs go? <laughs> yeah, well, well, the damage wasn't too bad once I got to the parts. So I was able to fix it right away. You've got a lot of nerve saying that when you use Nekamaro's parts without my permission. Hey, hey. Well, I mean, even so. Now then. Anyway, now that we're all here, why don't we hurry up and try it out? What will happen if you press the button to Strawberry Hall's door? Even so. But there's no way it'll open. You haven't done anything about the chain. The door to Strawberry Hall behind Nekamaro's body was blocked off by that chain, remember? If you didn't do anything about it, it doesn't even matter if you fix the button on the outside. <laughs> <clears throat> well, we'll know if we try it out. It's not even worth trying out. No, we've all come this far. If he's saying we should try it out, then we should give it a shot. Yep. Yeah, that'd be great. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? But I'm assuming that it's gonna open because the center rotates, not the things around it. Like the buildings stay the same, obviously. It's just, it, I'm, I'm wondering if that's the whole point that we're trying to do, but let me just talk to everybody real quick. Mm. Nagito seems really confident about it. Hmm, I wonder why. Maybe he knows something. All right, Gundam. Fine. There's no need for the skyline lamentation art of the demon. Okay. You said you're making eight o'clock service or 11 o'clock? Both of them, got it, heard you. I shall let you fiends press the button. Huh? Just so you all know, my repairs are perfect. If the door doesn't open, it's because of that chain, you know? All right, and Nagito. Hey. Now then, can you hurry up and press the button already, you slow motherfucker? All right. With the feeling of resignation, I press the button, and here we freaking go. And the chain is gone. Huh? Hey, hey. Why did it open? Impossible. Where did the chain go? Hold it. Hold on a sec. That's not the only thing that's strange. The orientation of the freaking room. Ne uh, Nekamaro, the hammer, and a spot on the freaking pillar is the same as if I walked through the grave door. That's right. There's no other way to say it. This definitely looks weird. What do you mean? Huh? Look at Akane knowing that she killed Nekumar herself because she wanted to... Bro, I'm already knowing how this is going. Just by her reaction, looking to the side like she don't know. She's trying to figure out, hold on, where did my chain go? Like, we hey, see you. Hey. hey. Or Sonya. Sonya's a prime suspect as well. I'm looking at both of them crazy. Hey. Doesn't this all look the same as when we were in the Grape Tower? Yeah, you're right. When we were inside Grape Tower, Nagumaro's body was in front of the far back door. Yep. 
which means his body should have been in front of the door to Strawberry Hall. So if we enter from Strawberry Hall, he should, he should be right in front of the door as we walked in. Why isn't it like that? Then maybe I have my, my, my prediction wrong. It's not the inside that changes. It's everything around it. It's the same door. I feel like an idiot, bro. I know I'm, I'm right there, bro. Why is Nekumaro's body in front of the door to Great Paul? No, 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 no. I had it right. Everything on the inside just rotates. Everything on the inside. So, you, so like, if he's on one side, I, let's say I'm right here on Grape Tower door, right? He's far away from me. If I, if I take the elevator, so, so I walk out the tower, I take the elevator. Maybe I'm just sitting there and then it rotates. Wait a minute, how did I get to the freaking elevator? Oh, right, the elevator takes me. I need to see the illustration again, bro. Thank you. Oh, okay, they're gonna show me this one. Not just that. The parts that I carefully arranged when I disassembled the body all moved too. Um. The body isn't the only thing that moved. Even the tipped over pillar and the spilled oil. They've all moved the exact same way. <coughs> Excuse me. The crime scene looks identical to how we saw it when we entered from Grape Hall. Everything that was at the crime scene inside Grape Tower shifted to the opposite side. As if it all rotated 180 degrees, right? I can't imagine that the floor actually rotated 180 degrees, but... Is that really what this means? No. It's more than that. I feel like there's an even greater mystery here. A mystery so great that it could drastically affect the outcome of this case. We might... We might have to rethink this. We might need to fundamentally rethink how we've been approaching this case. Strange feeling in tower. Chain. I see. The chain disappeared. This strange feeling I felt when I went back and forth between the two towers. <laughs> yep. Just as I thought. It was definitely the right choice to confirm this. Just as you thought? Then you already knew about this mystery. <sighs> you have a bad habit of relying on others when you don't understand. Why don't you try investigating first? See? That door at the far back with the picture of a grape on it. Maybe there's a clue hidden there. Get away from me. <laughs> don't he give you that vibe? Like, bro, we're s you don't know if you want to work with us or against us at every given moment, bro. It's like every sentence that you speak, you, you, you dissect. Should I be a friend or an enemy? Like, stop! There's a clue on that door. It's the door with the picture of grapes on it. This should lead to Grape Hall. Wait, huh? One of the doorknobs is gone. I didn't even see that. It's like the screws came out with it. Now then. It's the same as that doorknob that was on the floor. See? See? The screws came out with it, right? Whoa. Then the doorknob next to Nekomaru's body came off the door to Grape Hall. Well, well, that's what it looks like. When you said clue, were you talking about this? But what is it a clue to? Probably to the way the room works, Haji. I'm gonna let you know right now. I'm gonna take, cause my dad actually, you know how my mom was just here not too long ago? My dad actually is coming next. They did not want to be here at the same time. It's hilarious. But my dad is actually visiting next. <clears throat> He's going to be here until Monday. While over these next few days, actually, I'm going to take one day and just rewatch the last two to three episodes of this chapter so that I don't miss any clues in this next trial and sound like a complete buffoon. Huh? Did you get even more confused? <laughs> no need to worry. Just one clue will change everything. Huh? All the mysteries will be solved as if everything were linked together. If 
You can reach it. Just like I did. What? Does that even mean, bro? Even if I ask him that, Nagito probably won't give me an answer. So it would just be a waste of time to even ask. I'm not ready, bro. It appears that it's time for the class trial. I, I told y'all. I told y'all exactly what could happen, bro. It could be a 10 to 20 minute video, bro. I'm sorry, bro. This will be the last time dang it ever happens like this. I didn't know last time. The last episode before this was two and a half hours long. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. I could have I could have merged them together, but I didn't know. And I still learned a lot of information in this last little video. Y'all need y'all needed this information just like I did. Now we both can go back, refresh our memory of the of the information. It's been two months, bro. We gotta refresh. But I did promise on the dangin video, so you know you can't get mad at the length as long as you get the product. It appears that it's time for a class trial. To tell you the truth, I'm tired. Extremely tired. I feel like spending the rest of my life hibernating already. Man, I know it's bad, but I'm so sleepy. I just want to ditch. <sighs> Though I really don't feel like it. I'll show you my serious side when you come to the class trial. Even though it's impossible since it's so annoying, you can count on me to take this seriously. Whoa. Why is he so tired? Hold on. No, because we're all here. Because remember, in the first game, Mon well, in all these games, Monokuma is controlled by somebody. We have all not been able to eat. Or we'll be able to eat. Yeah, we all ate. We all ate already. Unless. Let me stop. Looks like it's going to start. Another class trial. Hey, hey. But how are we supposed to get to the trial ground? Damn it. You're right. We can't do anything unless we get out of this building. Hmm. Hmm. Um. Akane, did something happen? Hey, hey. No. Well, do you guys hear something? Hear something? Hey, hey. What do you hear this time? Suddenly, as if cutting off Chiaki. Our surroundings started to shake and rumble. Nakamura pooed it again. And then, it suddenly appeared before us. Splash. Ew, that, what is that? You need to go to the doctor if you're making a sound on the toilet. What? Did that just kill everybody? Well, where did my people go? Let my pe- Oh, okay, there we go. Is he telling us to go inside from here? Um, Seems that way. Like, Chiaki, why are you acting normal? Like, this nigga didn't just bust out the ground. Like, you play too many games. What you be playing, Dig Dug? Some of y'all don't even know what Dig Dug is. I'm talking to... I'm a boomer, I'm a boomer. I'm a boomer, I'm a boomer, I'm a boomer. I'm gonna go. I don't think she'd be the killer if she was that excited for this. Just hold on, Nekamaru. I'll make sure I avenge you. Jeez, you're pathetic. Jeez. At least be a little cautious. It's obviously a trap. It appears you cannot escape. I agree. I detect the scent of danger. Even my familiars are saying, do not go inside. It's nearly How showtime. interesting. If you can kill me, you're welcome to try. Try stabbing your sword through my very heart. <laughs> Move. Um, N now then, we shall get moving as well. Why are you so scared? You wasn't even close to Nekamaru. Fake ass Princess Peach. I'll snatch that emerald off, off, your, off your ass, Scott. Yep. Yeah, you're right. Uh. It's annoying, but if Miss Sonya is going, there's no way I'm not going to go. 
Miss Sonya and him could be working together. He a whole ass mechanic, disassembled Nekamaru, and she acting like she didn't want to do it, but she did. She didn't have to do it. So she's glad he did. I'm on to you. What? I guess it doesn't matter if it's a trap or not. One by one, everyone went into Monokuma Rock until I was the only one left. And when I was about to take a step forward, we're the same. The same step ladders. What? Nagito was suddenly standing next to me with his eyes locked onto Monokuma Rock. Other than the small movements of his mouth, he was perfectly still. Whoa. You and I are just step ladders for everyone who holds the title of ultimate. I always believed that I didn't mind. Unlike you, I know my place. W what are you saying? Man. That's why I was prepared to become a sacrifice at any time. And from that, true hope would be born. I always believed that the talent that survived, that survived, would be true hope. Damn it. But it wasn't. There's no hope amidst all this killing. Uh, of course there isn't. What kind of hope comes from killing people, Nagito? What? <laughs> really? Are you suggesting that sacrificing others for hope isn't real hope. But you're wrong. It's only natural and extremely obvious that strong hope devours weak hope. Isn't that right? After all, that's what it means to live, right? Th there's no way I'm gonna accept that. Well. Oh well. It's not like that's what I wanted to say to you anyway. Hey, there's this one novel I like. It's a peculiar mystery story. Huh? A novel? Um. The story is told from the point of view of a high school girl involved in a serial killer mystery. But when you get to the end, <laughs> surprise, surprise, the girl was actually the killer. Of course, the story is written carefully so the reader doesn't learn the ending in the middle of the story. So they're saying that a big ass plot twist is coming my way and I wasn't prepared for it? Got it. The protagonist is just a projection of the reader. And this projection turns out to be the killer. Which means the killer you were looking for the whole time was inside you all along. How do you feel about novels like that? What the heck are you talking about? You're just jumping from one topic to another. And. I can't comment on a book that I've never read before. No good at all. Such a normal answer. I should have expected that from a talentless reserve course student like you. Damn! <laughs> but I know that you don't matter at all, so why do I care about you? You admire hope. I'd love hope. Right? In some ways we're similar, but maybe that difference is what's making me so emotional. Enough already! I don't have time to argue with you. Let's go! Everyone is waiting. Man. Everyone, huh? So you still believe you're just like everyone else. This nigga is nuts, bro. How do I how do I lower this text so I can make you the thumbnail? Golly, you nuts, bro. I don't even know how to do it no more. <laughs> Reserve course students are so full of themselves. <laughs> Nagito's chilling laugh continued as he disappeared into Monokuma Rock. Calm down. That's right. I need to calm down. I took several deep breaths, and once my nerves had settled, I stepped into Monokuma Rock. One, two, three, four, five, seven of us left. Eight of us left, I'm sorry. 
The elevator shook violently as it descended in, at an ever increasing speed. Hey. When we were in normal elevators, when we're in a normal eleva elevator that shakes this bad, it reminds me of how efficient that elevator in the funhouse was. Well, yeah. It's probably true. The elevator continued to shake and descended deeper and deeper. And suddenly, it stopped like it always does. And the door opened. Well, now. I understand your desire to applaud this wonderfully vulgar trial ground. It's kind of clean. But it's so exhausting to discuss useless things, so let's just get on with it already. <laughs> so sad. My chest hurts. Forcing everyone to do this is so sad. Hey, come on now. Don't go talking without my permission after I've said my catchphrase. Now I'm Otherwise, ready. I'll roll a dice yeah, and great. based on the result, I'll give you a sex change operation that many times. This nigga is, he got real torture on his mind. He got that LTG type of, type of imagery, bro. <laughs> Get that ass banned. What an extreme punishment. Now then. Let's get on with it once again. <laughs> Let's get a move on, boys and girls. And so it begins. I hope this would never happen again. And now it's happening for the fourth freaking time. The curtain to the fourth class trial was about to open. Nekumaro Nidai, the ultimate team manager. He was more passionate, more daring, more honest than anyone I'd ever met. Truly, he was more man than any of us. He sacrificed his body to protect Akane, and his appearance changed drastically because of that. But he still tried to live earnestly. And just when I finally got used to this new form, Nekumaro's killer. Is one of us killing someone because it's the only way to survive? It's no excuse. It's crazy to see how many people have come and gone already. Wow, I won't let this be excused. I won't forgive this. The person who betrayed Nekomaru, who betrayed their friends, I will never, ever forgive them. And so, this life-threatening trial billowing with hope and despair has begun. Ooh! Ooh! I'm hype all over again! Let me do my research though, because I definitely need to understand what all we've seen across the way I'm gonna enjoy this too, cause the last trial really kind of threw me off with this game. I believe this one will be better, but y'all have told me the last trial of this whole game is the best in the entire series. I don't know if I'm gonna do volume three yet, but I'm not gonna cut it off completely because I feel like this year, because I got a team in place, we're doing things a little bit differently. I'm actually enjoying myself playing games and not thinking. Uh, you know, not even finna do all that to y'all right now. Just know I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna understand the story We're gonna get through this trial and we're gonna get through this freaking game I love each and every one of you if you enjoyed this video Make sure you hit that like button subscribe if you are new turn on the post notification bell So, you know when I'm posting videos and posting premieres I go live on twitch.tv slash Verlizzi. Make sure you download the app and follow me over there as well Yo, like I said love y'all and I will see you in the next video come prepare for this trial bring your snacks bring your juice boxes And let's find out who killed our boy because he did not deserve it. You didn't have to do it. And I'm going to find out who did. Bitch ass nigga. Peace, y'all. <laughs>